The Makers of the Pit. Zonwas was the last king of Homer tribe, well known as the Makers of the Pit, who came to the throne and took complete control of the affairs in that land. He accepted the religion of the Jews and announced it to be the former religion of the tribe, though Judaism was somehow abandoned. After the prophet's hood of Jesus Christ, and was no more a widespread religion. Zenois started to fight Christianity severely and was ready to do anything to abolish it. Therefore, he beheaded any Christians coming to his land and instead honored the Jewish people. He was absolutely determined to spread Judaism all over the world and make it the formal religion of all human beings. Thus, the first step for him was to abolish all other religions. Once he was informed that the inhabitants of the city of Najran had accepted Christianity, and except for some few ones, they had all rejected Judaism. This news made Zunwas so furious that he immediately commanded to wage a war with them. The next day, he was on the way to Najran with a great, well-equipped army. They stopped on a land close to Najran. Sonwas sent his agents to the city to bring the lords and the nobles of that city to his presence. When they attended to his presence, he addressed them like this. I have been informed that the trickery of a Christian man have caused you to reject Judaism and accept Christianity as your religion. I've come to invite you to Judaism once again and make you repent for this deviation of yours. Otherwise, I shall order a horrible punishment for you and shall not let any of you and your followers stay alive in this land. The nobles of Najran stipulated quite firmly and rigorously, We need not consult with anybody about our religion. We have found the true religion of God and shall not fear any punishment of yours. Zunoas did not accept to hear such a response, ordered to dig great holes and ditches in the ground and put up a huge fire in them. Then he ordered to capture those who have accepted Christianity and put them in fire while still alive. His army slaughtered those faithful believers by putting them in fire, murdering them with swords or mutilating them. Before reaching a stage that there would remain no Christian in that land, One of them could manage to escape on horseback and ride to Rome. There he attended to the presence of Caesar, the Roman emperor, and informed him of that massacre. Caesar, being a Christian himself, wrote a letter to Nijus and asked him to fight with Zonwas. When Nijus received this letter, he took his whole army to Yemen, fought and defeated Zonwas. During this war, they killed Zonwas and the number of Jewish people, and thus joined Yemen to Abyssinia. After Zonwas' death, Judaism was again deserted, and Christianity became prevalent and became the formal religion again.